Welcome to a new tutorial. So today um, we're going to create a tutorial on creating coupons for your event. So first you want to select the event that you're wanting to edit. For this one, we're going to use the Dallas, Texas social media event. And then in order to edit the, or in order to create coupons, you need to click on coupons. It should be right around this area. You're going to click there. And there could be a number of different reasons why you um, create a coupon. There could be that you are wanting to give free access to like maybe volunteers or certain types of sponsors. Maybe in the case of you want people to register online, but if they paid you with like cash or check, you want them to be able to register without having to pay a second time. So there's a number of different reasons why you could want to add a coupon to your event. But in order to add one, you need to click on add new coupon here in the right hand corner. And then you're going to um, make the coupon name. And so I'll make a coupon that's just for volunteer. And then the uh, coupon name could be volunteer 2019. You can choose either um, percentage or dollar amount. And for the coupon code, this is like the code that the user is gonna put into the system to activate the coupon. And then this is the just the name. So like this is like more of a internal thing for you to know what it is. And then this is what the user is actually gonna be using. And you can choose dollar amount or percentage. I'm gonna use percentage for this example. And then you can um, create any percentage that you'd like. So you could do 20%, 100%, whatever the case is. This is um, for like if you need to need a minimum purchase in order for the coupon code to be activated. So if you want somebody to spend like over $200 until and unless they spend $200, this coupon wouldn't be active. So this is a minimum purchase and you can make that anything that you want. And the number of uses, this is just to like, if you want to limit the number of uses, say that like you only want 30 people to have, um, to be able to use that coupon, you would select that and then you would enter the amount of people you want to be eligible to use that coupon. And then enabled, make sure that you click this because if you click this, if you don't click this, but you save the coupon, um, the coupon won't be active. So the coupon is not active until you select yes, this coupon is enabled and can be used. Expiration date, um, our event is March 1st, 2019. So we'll just make that the expiration date, but you can set the expiration date for like anything that you want. And then here you can decide like, okay, do you want this to apply to packages? You want this to apply to tickets, to sponsor levels? I'm just gonna, I'm gonna deselect sponsor levels and I'm just gonna say it only applies to tickets, but you can customize this as much as you want. Like you can say which type of tickets you want it to apply to, which type of packages you want it to apply to and really customize it there. And then once you're content with it, you're gonna click save. And then as you can see, uh, the volunteer discount has been added. So you can add as many um, coupons as you want to or as you need to, and you can customize them however you would like. So that is how you add a coupon to your event.